Breast ironing. Breast ironing is a traditional practice that affects women and girls. It will typically begin soon after puberty, and since there's no specific age that puberty starts, a child may be subjected to the practice at any age, as soon as they begin to develop breasts. Breast ironing is a practice designed to make girls look less womanly and typically begins in the home. The thinking is that a child will be safer from unwanted male advances if they physically hinder or delay the outward development of their breasts. The misconception is that they're protecting the girl from harassment, protecting them from rape, abduction or early forced marriage. Or simply, without distraction, a child could focus on their education. It's often a misplaced act of protection or love, yet unlike other preventative measures, it provides no health or any other benefits. It's mostly done by female members of the family, by an auntie, a grandmother, elder sister or nanny. They apply heat using tools like hot stones, a wooden spoon or a pestle. These tools may have been used across generations to burn and suppress the breast tissue. It happens gradually over a period of time. Over the duration of this practice, the breasts will be painful and contained with an elastic band or bandage to hinder development. The practice will continue until the breasts stop growing. There will be health implications such as pain or discomfort. There may be anxiety or other psychological consequences, including trying to understand how a caring parent can inflict this type of pain. The practice is more common in West and Central Africa, yet has no borders. It occurs all over the world and has migrated with people and cultures to the UK. It's important that we are not judgmental of cultural practices, yet this is a human rights issue and violates the rights of the child. It's the responsibility of everyone within the community, especially those in different professional groups, to be vigilant and take action to safeguard girls. This following course will take you through in more detail about breast ironing and how we can help to educate and raise awareness about the consequences of this practice.